Yeah, good morning. This is the start of day 12. I just about managed to get up before sunrise and get everything ready. Um, anyway, I'll do another video on day 12 later. Today I'll talk a little bit, or sorry, now I'll talk a little bit more about day 10 and day 11. So a bit more detail on the last two days. So that's days um, 10 and 11. Yep, after the thunderstorm, which I recorded in my last video. Yeah, so I started in this shop that had lots of Milan uh, stuff. AC Milan stuff. thought that was kind of funny. Just a random grocery store quite far from Milan. Had all of this stuff. So anyway, um, yeah, some nice scenery as usual. And there's the bike. Um, ah yes, I stopped in a stream for a few hours. So from midday till 3pm. Um, beside a small river to do yeah, dry stuff, wash stuff. I think it was in somebody's private property. Like when I was going down there was a an old man, but I'm pretty sure he didn't see me. And uh, anyway, I just went ahead. Um, like, def uh, yeah, so a couple of photos like that. Um, like I say, it, it might have been public land, but possibly private. Yeah, I didn't do so much on that day. Um, just went up Paso Duran eventually. Oh. And uh, yeah, that. Um, well, I had a couple of steep bits, but otherwise, the main thing was that when I got to the car, oh, yep, Paso Duran, there was a nice refuge there, and people were setting up their tents. And uh, I didn't think there would be anything there. I thought I would just take a photo and continue on, but then I was tempted to have food, and most importantly, as well, uh, there was a good place to sleep and also charge up my batteries in the refuge. So that was a short day. Then, um, oh yeah, here's the dinner I had there. So that's probably the end of day 10. Or actually, I took that when it was dark and night mode in my camera. Again, I think all of this is still from the top of Paso Duran. All right, so this must be the morning of um, the 11th, the 11th day. I don't mean the 11th of the month, the 11th day of my trip, i.e. yesterday. So, um, just taking a few photos on the way down. This was also a relatively short day. Um, oh yeah, Commute gave some crazy directions for a, a cycle lane that hasn't been built yet, I think. And so this is going up past Fedaya. Ah, yes. So, um, yeah, another steep ish, well, another climb, a thousand meters of ascent. Not, to, not so steep actually, it's relatively long. That was the highlight of yesterday. Some great views. Yes, I'm finally in the, the parts of the Dolomites, like the, the fa most famous bit. So we just went up to the top of that and um, yeah, Paso Vidalia, one of the famous climbs. Here it is, here's the top, here's the pass itself. That building there, I don't know what it is, but I slept behind that. <laughs> A bit cheeky, but it's some ski infrastructure building so I could tell that uh, well I was pretty confident that there would be no problem hiding behind it and nothing's happening this kind of year so yeah a few more photos and then this is this morning so still at the top of Paso Fidaya and uh, a couple of photos okay good morning